Hello guys, welcome to you. In this video, we are going to see how to fix add your crackling or popping sound issue in a Windows 11 PC or laptop. It is a very simple error and I give the multiple solution to fix this error. Before go to the, this video, if you not subscribe the channel, then subscribe the channel and also click on the bell icon. So let's go to our video. Our first method is very simple. Go to the start. Right click on the start. Here we find device manager. Click on the device manager. In a device manager, I center it. In a device manager, here we find first option is add your input and outputs. Click at here. Click on here and go to the, your device. Go to the, your audio device. In this case, this is the, my audio device. Go to the, your audio device that has a problem. Here we find our all attached audio device. Click on the, your audio device. Right click on the, your audio add you and click on the update first option is click on the update drivers after that here we find many options go to the here here we find browse my computer for drivers browse my computer for drivers after that here we find many option if you have drivers on your pc or laptop then click on the browse and install the drivers if not then don't worry click at here let me pick for a latest available drivers on my computer, click at here. And here we find our installed drivers. If latest driver, this is the latest drivers. If this latest drivers is not working with the, your PC or laptop, then go to the, this second drivers and next, next, next and install. In my case, my drivers are already installed and properly working. So I not go to the install it or update it. Click at here and update the, your drivers with the backdated drivers okay this is the, our first solution our first solution is very simple our second solution is also very simple close it our second solution is we are going to change the our power plan settings that is very easy and simple go to the start type control panel click on the control panel in a control panel we find many options go to the large icons and change it to the go to their categories or the small icons and click on the large icons in a large icons in a settings we find Control, in a control panel, we find power options. Click on the power options. In a power options, if you find high performance at here, then click on the high performance. If high performance is not selected, then show additional pan. And here we find high performance. Go with the high performance. And here we find change plan settings. Click at here. And go to here, change advanced power settings. And make a center it and go to the here processor power management and make sure these all things are 100% click on the if it's not 100% then go with the 100% click on the ok and close it and after that restart your machine and your problem is solved if not solved then I give the another option another option is go to the start and type control panel click on the control panel in a control panel we find many options go to the sound go to the sound click on the sound and i close it and code i make it center it and go to the here playback and select the your device add your device select the your device in this case i select this device right click on the your device and click on the properties in a property we find special sounds click on the special sound and make sure it is off click on the off if it's not off then click on the off click on the ok and click on the ok and restart your machine and your problem is solved our fourth method is also simple go to the start right click on the start here we find device manager click on the device manager and go to the add your input and outputs click at here and if you want to select this add your, add your device as a your default add your, Add your device then remove this other device remove this other device sometimes your other devices are config with the your device that is the problem then right click on it and click on the uninstall device or disable device click on the disable devices very imp disable that devices and go with the your default device your working device and it's also work with some cases so guys this is the four multiple ways to solve this simple problem on our audio audio devices speaker headphone or monitor speakers it's work with the all audio device so guys thank you for watching this video don't forget to like share
comment on this video and don't forget to subscribe the channel. Thank you guys.